same day. Huh, what's been going on? Oh, it's Connor, shit. I love Connor. Reckon if we killed Connor at the start, would, would this all just not happen? Or would like another replacement Connor come in? It says no androids allowed, and he just steps in like a fucking boss. Find Lieutenant Anderson. Jimmy Peterson. No criminal record. Born in 2001. Oh, this guy here. Edward Dempsey, administrator, no criminal record. Shit, I thought I had your... Uh, Derek Myers, security guard. Hey, finally a, a, a guy younger than me in real life. Older, I mean. Jonah Graham, unemployed though. Oh shit. Nope, I don't want to scan this guy, I want this guy. Criminal record DUI for Christopher Gray. It's your problem. I wanna scan you, old man. Oh, there he is. Hank Anderson. Oh jeez, where do you come from? Delivery driver, domestic abuse, of course. Dennis Ward, narcot. Mm. Is there some sort of dr drug? Is there some sort of drug deal going on? Chris Roberts is some who's unemployed. And uh Samuel McCray. Check. Hey, get out of here. I love that Connor's wearing jeans. Oh my god, can I? No! Uh, I'm not allowed. You asshole, stop hogging the machine. Right, I'm supposed to talk to this guy. Talk. Lieutenant Anderson, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. Just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Um, under understanding. I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids, but I, I am perfectly comfortable. Are you? Back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. Uh, persist. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I must insist. My instructions stipulate that I have to accompany you. You know where you can stick your instructions? <laughs> no. Where? <laughs> Never mind. Look, I'll buy you another drink. Just come along. You know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? Bartender? The same again, please. See, that gym wonders the technology. Make it a double. 
Connor's like, the fuck? I bought you a single. He's got a good old man outside. face. I like it. Yes, I did. Let's go. Oh, I thought that was... <laughs> Patient. Whatever you say, Lieutenant. Fucking man, Conflicting orders, selecting priority. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Oh shit! This is kind of just pop. Oh my god, they're like twins. Well, I guess there's nothing I can do here. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. You're an android. Your order contradicted my instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Evening, Hank. We were starting to think you weren't going to show. Yeah, oh, I you look familiar. Until this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. You got a call around eight from the landlord. Lieutenant hadn't paid his rent for a few months, so he thought he'd drop. All right, let's go see this body then. Of Carlos Ortiz. Smell. It was even worse before we opened the windows. Oof. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. He has a record for theft and aggravated assault. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever saw him. Well, stayed easy. In. Wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Could have waited till morning. I'd say he's been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. Any sign of a break-in? Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his android? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. Well, I, I gotta get some air. Make yourself at home. I'll be outside if you need me. All right, let me investigate. Review ten, not our ten evidence. Sir. Each letter is perfect. It's way too neat. No human rights like this. Chris, was this written in the victim's blood? I would say so. We're taking samples for analysis. Okay. Uh, 28 knife wounds. Uh, red eyes. Oh, he's been abusing the drugs. Oh. Deceased, Carlos Ortiz. Is it more drugs? Now fingerprints, theft, and aggravated assaults. Victim fell here. Victim was stabbed. Well, of course he was. They came from the kitchen. Stabbed 28 times. Yeah. 
Seems like the killer really had it in for him. Analyze? Nope, oh, nope, no, 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 sample. Oh, Jesus, what the hell are you doing? I'm analyzing the blood. I can check samples in real time. I'm sorry. I should have warned you. Okay, just don't put any more evidence in your mouth. You got it? Got it. <sighs> Fucking hell, I can't believe this shit. Uh, dry blood from Carlos Ortiz. Regular f letters von Cyber Life Sands. Well, I guess that confirms it, huh? Red ice. Seems our friend Carlos liked the party. Chris, I want full analysis on the narcotics. Consider it done, Lieutenant. Yep. Drugs. Victim used drugs. No fingerprints. Android involvement? Well... Hey Mike, you finished taking samples there? Yeah. That... Try blood. That's it. Ah. Nothing out of the ordinary. The Eden Club, come visit us. Okay, nothing more I can do here. Oh, I saw something behind as well. Ah. Yep, that is, got got some blood there. Uh, some blood on the wall. Oh shit, there's a bunch of evidence here. Outside. Maybe the android ran away. Uh -huh. Analyze. Uh, model something. Door was locked from the inside. Killer must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins' size 10 shoes. Well, this happened weeks ago. The tracks could have faded. No, this type of soil would retain a trace. Nobody's been out here for a long time. Deviant didn't escape this way. I think out of all the three androids so far, my favorite is Connor. Oh, that's his uh, signs of a struggle. Read. Ah, oh, finally, something. Oh. Android sex officially better. Sorry, ladies, but plastic can't be beat. Mark Water and, De and Nancy Reese step out together. Android sex officially better. The results of the survey are in, and it's official. 68% of men prefer sex with an android to a real human. And with 32% of men saying that they've tried the experience at least once, that's a lot of android love to go around. There were a few, re there were a few reasons given to this pre preference, but we think we know the real reason. Androids don't want to talk about their feelings afterwards. The story is sponsored by the Eden Club. Discretion is our middle, middle name. Is your android spying on you? Cyberlife could be using its android to collect private information. More and more experts are suggesting that Cyberlife uses its 120 million androids to record the details of private conversations of its customers and sell them to trading partners. Ever talked about buying that new car while eating dinner with your partner? Cyberlife could be using that information for targeted advertising. 
the information goldmine doesn't stop there. Everything from personal indiscretions to political affiliations could easily be extracted from potentially and potentially used for nefarious purposes. Uh, the spate of reports linking Warren's presidency to cyberlife only deepen such concerns. Several consumer rights organizations have requested that cyberlife disclose that information it gathers and who it sells that information to, but the company has always refused. Request for a formal inquiry has gone unanswered so far. Huh. Can't see shit. Oh, there, there, there was a knife. Still two more. Okay. We can reconstruct. Whoa! Deviant took a knife. Oh shit. But the guy was hitting. The, it was like beating the shit out of his android. I'm missing one evidence though. Where is it? Excessive writing. And a weird statue thing. Religious offering? Is that a clue? That, 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 that is a clue. Anderson. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah? Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started... In the kitchen. In the kitchen. There are obvious signs of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android... With the bat. With the bat. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. Android took a knife. Uh, the android stabbed the, android the victim. Stabbed the victim. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to. The living room. The living room. He's doing some sick combos on him. And he tried to get away from the android. Alright, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim. With the knife. With the knife. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. But it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Therium. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' bio components. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh, Did the sound mixing go nuts? But I bet there? you can still see it, can't you? Yes. Correct. Yeah. All right. We're going back to the kitchen.
So, yep, definite struggle there. Oh, lots of blue blood there. Bathroom, maybe? Okay. So, he used that. Well, it still doesn't say where he... Oh, oh shit, okay. I'll do the open later. Examine. A ladder was used. Wait, how... Oh, shit, okay, never mind. Look. Traces lead to the attic. Ah, oh, Connor's also in distress. Find something to climb. Well, I'll take a chair. Chair. I'm going to check something. Uh, I'm going to check something. Open. Oh boy. Search attic. Well, that's the la there's the ladder. There's a lot of blue blood around. Attic's got lots of holes in it. He probably like left. But follow the blue blood though. <laughs> Expect it. Expect it. There'd be a fucking mannequin in here. <gasps> is that him? Or is that another mannequin? It is him! Ready for a fight. Oh, I'm ready for some QTEs. Oh, there you are. Oh, shit, he's got a red eye. Found you. I was just defending myself. He was gonna kill me. I'm begging you. Don't tell him. Connor, what the fuck is going on up there? It's here, Lieutenant. Oh shit. Chris, Ben! Get your asses in here now. Well, come on. Oof. I guess um Connor's a snitch. Found Deviant, huh? Is there a way I couldn't have found the Deviant? Check shower. Examine the statue, and that was it. Connor knows what happened, and the other one would be like Connor didn't know what happened. All right, all right, that's a 
This is a. Uh, this game has a lot of paths. I need to like. Th there is the replay value of this. I I'll give it that.